Hey guys, hello. Um, it's Friday. I'm eating a piece of pizza. I'm so healthy. Um, what time is it? I don't even have my watch on. It's four o'clock. We just got home. Um, we spent the night at my mom's last night. We haven't really missed much. We just, we had breakfast. I released new releases. I worked on the kit for Black Friday. I'm so excited. And that's about it. We came home. Um, we are moving the vanity out of the bathroom this evening. Pulling up the linoleum and kind of assessing the situation to see what we need to do for the floor. And I've got a few orders that I have to get done today. Like they're marked as needing to be shipped today. So I think there's nine of them. So I'm gonna work on that too. But other than that, I don't know what will get done. I do know I need to do some more computer work. Um, so it will kind of be like kind of a, whoa, I just moved the table, sorry. Like a back and forth kind of thing this weekend. I've got work to do, but I also want to work in the bathroom. So I'm just gonna have to try to balance all of that out. Do you see this? Can you see him? He's, he's begging for, for pizza. I'll give you a piece of ham. Little tiny piece of ham. Yeah? Alright, let's get busy. to be done so I'm printing the postage now we got the vanity took out of the bathroom and we already had an injury it was me I injured my toe I went to walk and it was I hit it I hit it with my toe and ended up like splitting my nail down the center a little bit and it was bleeding it's fine everything's fine it hurt but it's fine um and Casey halfway got the linoleum took up just to kind of see what it looked like under there. It's actually not as bad as we thought that it was going to be. So, um, that's good. But he's feeling kind of yucky right now. He feels like he's getting like sinusy sick. So, I've got the humidifier going in there for him. And I'm going to finish this up. I may go in there and tear the rest of the linoleum up. I don't know. It's only 8 o'clock. I also need to do some design work, so. The night is still young.
his and hers. I like biscuits. Got the fan going, machines going, boiling machine going. It always gets so hot in here with that thing, but um, it is 11:30. I've been up since about 8:30. Um, Casey is officially sick. He's got a sore throat, coughing. I'm trying to stay away. I'm keeping him fed and hydrated, but keeping my distance. So, I do not need to be sick. This is like Black Friday prep, you know? This will be the worst time for me to get sick. Although, my throat has hurt me for the past couple days, so. <laughs> do some work. I don't know how much of the bathroom will get done this weekend. I'm going to do as much as I can. Um, but top priority right now is just these orders. So I got to get to work. And uh, I think his main thing is he just has a headache. <laughs> um, he's not well with a headache. Um, but he is coughing and he's got like a sinus, sinus pressure headache, which is miserable, I know. But um, yeah, I got about 35, 40 orders done today. And I've got a few more that I need to get done. But I think I'm at a stopping point. Um, I made... Parker dinner. I'm making me dinner. I'm having Parmesan noodles. Here's my thing. Here's what happens. I bought all the healthy things and then I eat it. And then I don't go to the grocery store for like two more weeks. So then I'm left with all the unhealthy stuff. It's a vicious cycle. But anyway, I am printing off shipping labels. And I've got a few videos that I just absolutely have to film tonight. I just can't not. I need to design more, but I also want to go in there and tear. Like, there needs to be prep work done on that bathroom. I need to tear the rest of the linoleum up. And it's like, there's linoleum on top of linoleum. So, there's more linoleum underneath that I have to scrape off. And then... Put the caulking around the perimeter and clean and mop it and also have to put like a primer thing on it I think also before you pour it I think 
um, have like two different primers. I think one goes first, then the concrete, then another primer, then the floor. Um, so I've got to get that done, but I just don't know what to do with about the toilet situation yet. Like ultimately we do need to take it out, but like it's our only bathroom. So what do we do? I don't know. So anyway, I'm going to print this postage and eat me some dinner and then probably film. I need to get that done. Like work needs to be the priority. And if I have time to work in the bathroom, I will, but I just need to work. It's too close to Black Friday to not, you know what I mean? scraping the bathroom floor absolutely not am I going to I don't know I really need to design like a lot I'm really tired too it's been a long day um check back with me in a second because I don't know <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm trying the best I can. I got it all up, right? But I've come to the conclusion that the linoleum that was under the other linoleum, some of it comes up, some of it don't. Like it's on there. I really feel like if we pour on top of it, it's not going to get up and under it because it's glued down <laughs> I don't know it's probably not the right thing to do but that's what we're doing so now I'm going to take this quick seal and uh, go around the bottom here I'm just going off of YouTube videos okay and uh, it's supposed to well seal it right so that the concrete does not go up and under your wall. So I'm only going to do this, all this wall, and then that wall over there. This wall on the toilet side, Casey's gonna have to help me with it, because I don't know if I got an angle of it, but it's open, like that wall is open. He tore into it to get to the plumbing and everything, and because we we're going to put big board on there, he just left it open. We didn't bother with putting drywall back up, so we're going to have to figure something out there. We may end up having to drywall it. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to try to do this, and we'll see how it goes. I watched somebody do it, and they cut like a really big... My scissors suck. I'm scared to do this, you guys. <laughs> like, I've never done anything like this, so. My scissors are not wanting to cut. Okay. 
Nothing's coming out. <gasps> it came out the wrong way. What just happened? No, oh, it's coming out here. <laughs> oh no, I don't know what happened. Well, this is a true DIY <laughs> screw up. Um, don't look at my toe. That was my DIY, DIY yesterday. Um, Casey told me I didn't cut the hole big enough, but th I cut a big hole. <laughs> I have to wash this off somehow. I probably don't need to go down the sink though. Oh man, somebody like a professional watching me do this. Turn your head, okay? There's nothing to see here. First of all, wear gloves on both hands when you do that crap. I like to have never got that off of my hand because I only have one glove on. Secondly, and in my defense, Casey didn't tell me you had to puncture a hole in the top after you cut the top off. You have to puncture it down in it. I didn't know that. I've never used one of those. I guess I could have read directions, which is ultimately what I did to figure it out, but I got it, okay, I got it. I got that whole perimeter that I intended to, but like we're out now, so we'll have to get more caulk. We've got to finish the wall that the vanity's on and figure out the door and the toilet situation. Ultimately, you're supposed to take the toilet out. I broke a nail, I'm trying to fix my nail. <laughs> Um, ultimately, you're supposed to take the toilet out, which I think is because it will concrete the toilet in. And if you ever have to replace your toilet, your toilet's concreted in, I, th I think. So, I just don't know, because it's going to take several days to finish the floor. Because it's got to get concreted, it's got to dry, it's got to get primed, it's got to dry. It's got to get flooring put down and caulk, not caulk, grout put down and dry <laughs> before a toilet can go back in. So, I don't know. Be going in the woods, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, guys. So, we'll figure it out, but. I got that done. Okay, I got that done. So that's one step closer. Got a little bit prepped. Maybe Casey will feel better tomorrow and we can work on it a little bit more. But I have got design work that I need to do. It's 11.30 though. I'm exhausted, but I really have got to get it done. I've really only got a week 
to finish what I need to finish for Black Friday, so I gotta get on it. Because I know me. I don't. I usually wait till the last minute and I don't need to do that, so. I'm gonna go sit on the couch and design because if I go to bed, I'm gonna go to sleep. If I go to bed, Parker's gonna cuddle up next to me and I'm not gonna be able to do anything, so. I'm just gonna go sit on the couch for a couple hours and get that done and go crash out because I is tired but it's been a productive day I've gotten a lot done so yay to that for my vanity. I'm going to get it cleaned out and use the shelf on it before I put everything back in. And I got one that I could use in both of that. And also I'm thinking about covering my desk in there with it. Because that thing that I have is just not cutting it anymore. It's peel on stick. It's just marble. enough that I can do both things. We'll see. We shall see. <gasps> Hopefully we'll get some more work done in the bathroom today. I was hoping to already be laying floors, but This is started, you know.
find him. Boop. Boop. My hands are shaking. You're shaking? Yeah. Prefer. I think I need to eat. Uh, we should do that. Peanut butter and jellies? <laughs> no, I don't really Bacon want and cheese? Peanut butter and jelly. I don't know what I want. Uh, you don't want anything. <laughs> For sure. I don't want that. If you told me I don't want that, for sure. No way. No. All right, we've showered, we've ate. I made some pot stickers. I really have to order groceries tonight because that's just the type of food we have left. I need, I need more protein stuff and healthy stuff because I am getting my workouts in, but this is what always happens to me. I eat like crap, I work out, and nothing happens. And I get frustrated and I stop. Um... I'm just gonna have to do better about getting groceries, but any anyway, uh, Casey's going to go get a level because the one we need a bigger like we had just have small levels. We need a bigger level to assess the situation in the bathroom, and um, <clears throat> the bigger level that we had it burnt up and got fire last year, so. Um, he's going to do that, and we're going to figure something out in the bathroom. I think ultimately we're not going to take up the toilet. I just... <laughs> seems like a bad idea, <laughs> honestly. Um, but we're going to figure out what we need to do that the concrete doesn't go up against the toilet. So if we ever do have to replace the toilet, it won't be concreted in. I think that's the whole thing of why you need to take them up, so... Anyway, we are going to work a little bit more in the bathroom, but I'm finishing up. I just have like two, three, four, five, six orders here that I'm going to just cut and, excuse me, um, go ahead and get those out because I just want to start fresh tomorrow on a pick list and it's going to be so many of these pre-foiled goods. Um, so it's going to take quite a lot of effort from me this week um, on those. And um, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna try to finish these up. I've gotta pull stickers for at least one plan with me. Two would be great. I've gotta do a lot more design work. Um, and I've got to edit and upload a video that will go live tomorrow, so. Um, it is already five o'clock. <laughs> That's what I get for sleep until one. Sometimes I just, I've got to let myself rest. I just go, 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 go. Casey was watching me from the couch today in the kitchen. He's like, I just love your energy. I was like, I literally have no energy. But like, I just, I have to make myself keep going. Because if I don't, I'll just sit around and do nothing. Like, I just really... I just really want to sit around and do nothing, but I just can't, you know? Adulting, it's wonderful! Alright, I'm gonna get to cutting. It is a pretty good little, a good little stack here. Not too bad, but well, I just bent those. Um, it'll take me a couple hours, though, to get that done, so I'm gonna get to it. Oh my god. I'm just a hot mess all the time. I try so hard to have my hair down, but I just... I can't. I just can't! It's just too much. It's just too much, you know? Like, I want to cut it off, but then I know I'd really have to fix it, and I don't know. I'm just not there in my life right now where... I want to fix my hair every day, so this is what gets done. Well, I'm working on my second Red Bull already. Everything's fine.
Just let me catch it here. Just let me catch it. Just let me show it. I'll show you it. He's not gonna catch that for sure. No. No way. Did you do it on there so I couldn't get it? You know me so well. from the guy like shaking his dong and like just getting it everywhere. I just want to scrub around the toilet and scrub the base of the toilet and go ahead and put a coat of primer on it and it'll already be dry. Pause. A primer for the yeah. self leveler. Yep. Yeah. No, that makes sense. But anyway, I'm pretty sure I got this is what you use. This is for the towel. So once you pull this self-leveler and it dries. Prime it with this. This is fucking big. All purpose primers for self-leveling underlayments. Do this once or twice before you pour. Wow. So it seals it. So don't leak in it. But okay, so sub flooring is generally plywood. And the reason why you put that on there is because the plywood would soak up all the moisture out of that. This is just what that girl did. Okay. And I just took it to heart. I love looked it. looked amazing when it was done. You. I do bought you. everything she told me to buy. I got two sponges. What are those for? To put between the um, tile. Okay, so yeah. Exactly, so they're evenly spaced. Yeah. I love it. And then I finally got one of these. Oh, that's a corner thingy. So you make the weird cuts with it. Gosh. I mean, I'm going to need it for the rest of the house too. I love it. So I thought might as well. It's might as well. It's good time. Good as time as any. Good as time as any. Mark Barker! 
Hey guys, I did not realize that I had not filmed any more content after this one <laughs> video right here. So I didn't do an outro or anything. So I just wanted to say um, thank you guys for spending another weekend with us. We truly appreciate it. And let me know anything you want to see for future vlogs. Please like, subscribe, do all the things. You don't miss all the things. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.